Okay. Crowman here. You're watching Crowman 17. There is something major happening right here. A uh, helicopter circling around. And I'm gonna put my life on the line to find out. Looks like it has something to do with this building right here. Like there's something going on. Okay, now the helicopter's gone just like that. Maybe it's not that serious. Often that's the case. Good or bad, caught on camera, it's great. What's happening over here? There was a crazy dude took off his clothes and he ran to that garage. That's the gist. Crazy dude took off his clothes and ran to a garage. <laughs> oh, that's exciting. Thanks a lot. And the rain starts. Perfect timing. I don't even think it's 10 o'clock yet. Okay, well we have all these police units. I just walked right through that and nothing really happened. So I really can't say what's happening right now. All I know is there's a lot of people here. I have no idea what this is. I'm sure some people can tell me in... in... Howdy! What's going on? Does anyone know? I don't know. I heard some, some crazy guy took his shirt off or something. Nobody knows? No? All the people know what you're doing. We told everyone. Even oh. the cops. What'd you tell them? What, what, what happened? We called the cops. But what happened? Some guy running around naked? Yeah. Yeah, he was blocking his thing and running and then we saw him. Oh my god. Are you serious? Yes. We saw it. When I was there, I was holding on there. And then they were just skating naked. Skating around naked? Like he had. Like maybe it was a dare. Oh. Yeah, a dare. That, was like so that honestly, that almost sounds believable. I if never saw that. Before. God knows. A, maybe it was a dare. Wow. <laughs> that sounds plausible. It really does. Oh, and also they killed him. Wait, what? I think, they, police, what? I think the police killed them already. I don't know about look, that. Did you hear the ambulance? Did you hear any gunshots or something? Yeah, or I heard a gun right there, like, and then I saw, I saw a couple holding the gun. Okay, wh where do you think that happened? Inside here? I, I, I heard a gunshot. Okay, I guess. Okay, I'm gonna check. I don't see anything. I don't see blood or anything. Okay, this guy's got gloves on. So, I really can't say. Okay, so we're downtown San Jose. This is Crowman. Rain is starting to come down. 
we have a lot of witnesses over here, but they don't really know too much, except that some crazy guy took his clothes off or might have even gotten naked. And and I'm gonna walk it, go ahead and walk in and see what, what's going on. Okay. Got some guys right here. I'm just gonna investigate until they tell me I've gone too far. But I don't see much right now. Doesn't seem like anything really is happening here. Maybe the whole thing has gotten figured out. Okay, well here they come with the stretcher. Maybe they did shoot somebody. Maybe the guy is taken out. God knows. I'm gonna I'm gonna get it as close as I can and tell me they until they tell me that I've gone too far. Something has happened right here. They stopped with the stretcher right there, so maybe. Maybe something did happen. Okay, yeah. Okay, they have somebody over there, definitely. I hear them screaming. They're gonna give him on the little stretch right now. He's injured. Obviously, maybe they shot him. I would say that's probably the case. Sounds like they probably shot him. <laughs> My God. <laughs> I need to shut up now. I'm just gonna, I'm, all right. This part is I'm in a public place. They got the situation under control. Clearly they have the situation under control, I think. So... I'm gonna stop right here. Exactly what the crime was, I don't know. All I've heard so far is that the guy was naked or near naked running out into public. Nobody seems to be distressed at all, except for the guy who's been shot. Now I'd say he's either in a world of pain or he's drunk or on drugs because nobody sings like that when they're surrounded by police and being strapped to a chair. Of course I could be wrong. God knows. Don't take my word for it. Do your own investigation. Just waiting for them to get this guy up and maybe we can get a look at him.
obviously I haven't gotten close enough for them to tell me that I have gotten too close. So I'm gonna... I'm gonna poke a little closer. I head towards this wall here. Blue lives matter, don't forget that. In my opinion, he sounds like a guy high on speed or something. He's kind of fighting. Personally, I love SJPD. They are a very conservative group. And uh, if you have a problem with conservative police officers, you can go suck a fat one. Like uh, Tom Cruise said in in uh, oh, what was that movie? Forgot the new, forgot the movie, but he he, start, he started a movie where he said that uh, there are three things that police officers don't do, and one of those things, one of those three things that police officers don't do is vote Democrat. You know the police don't vote Democrat. All right, I'm gonna get a little closer and take a look at. Maybe who this fellow is. They got a bag over his head. Probably that's a spit bag. He's probably on drugs. I would say he's either crazy or on drugs or both. And he's spitting, so they put a spit bag over his head. That's understandable. The SJPD dress very nice. I admire that, and I don't, I don't want them to be spit on, spat on. And I agree with him not to be spat on. He probably had some weapon or something. Let's go. I don't know if he wants to block me or what's the deal. Beanies are not attractive or stylish. SJPD PD needs to get rid of the beanies. Give it the cowboy hat. Should have been a cowboy. No problem. I understand. He's naked. <laughs> You're right. That kind of footage would ruin my demonization. Wearing my six shoes, riding my cattle on a cattle drive. Oh, six shoes. <laughs> yeah. Pony. Yes. So if they get his junk covered up, then I can move in to get some better footage. I don't want to get any nudity or anything that I'm not allowed to shoot. But of course, a guy without a shirt on is what gets the best footage. <laughs> not lying there. Yeah, they seem like they have total control over this situation. This is not a problem right now. This is not a problem at all. It's just some probably PCP or speed user running around crazy uh, without his clothes on. That's what it sounds like to me. Obviously, uh, I, don't know, I don't know if he's missing a hand, if anyone else knows that. Or maybe he's 
got his raw, knuckles raw. Take a look at that right there. Okay, they're covering it up now. But yeah, it looks like his hand is raw or he's missing a hand or something like that. So, uh, oh, wow. This is something else. <laughs> he's kind of got his head up. He's just a naked guy. Everyone's freaking out about a naked guy. Don't let me commentate or let my commentations uh, decide what's happening here. Um, they're gonna just comment on your own and what you see here. They're gonna cover him up, which is a good thing. Maybe you recognize this 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 guy. What do you think? And San Jose's finest. Blue lives matter. Blue lives matter. I'm gonna ask these guys a question about a rally in San Jose. Can I ask you guys a question? Sure. Would you promote another pro-Trump rally in San Jose and protect the Ooh, citizens? We're not allowed to answer we questions on politics. Sorry. Sorry sir. Well, uh, I hope I want you to hear me right now that blue lives matter. Thank you. You're welcome. Well, that's all I'm going to do, guys. Thanks for tuning in. This is Crow Man, San Jose, downtown. Love you all. Thanks for supporting me. <laughs> Maybe less drinks in the future. Adios. Yes, todos unidos, se grande otra vez.